Hello, guys. Hello, Elena. How are you doing? Hi. I'm doing great. Thank nice you. to see you. Nice to see you too. How's everything going? How was your day? Did you do anything fun today? No, I didn't. I just worked. You only worked? Stay at home. Yeah. All right. That's cool. That's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. All right. What about you, Tanya? Anything fun today? Hello, good evening. Not at all. Not at it all? It has been like, no. It has been like um, a hot day, I think. Like the weather is too hot. Oh, and yeah, the weather is too hot. I don't know why, but I feel like boiling. <laughs> oh, my God. Where do you live? In Santa Tecla, but inside my house is horrible. <laughs> Oh, okay, yeah, because in Tecla, uh, it's not really that hot, you know? I was thinking yes. that you lived in San Miguel or something. I feel like that. <laughs> you feel like that? Yeah, that's that's actually pretty hot. No, I know, I know. I was outside today, but uh, I know the feeling. What about you, Mario? Enjoying the weather? Yeah. All, yeah, you are? All is good, yeah. I just took a shower, so I'm pretty refreshed. <laughs> okay, all right. That's good, man. That's good. What about you, Mr. Danny L? Oh, you have an issue with your audio again. I love your voice, the man. Voice. The demon voice coming out again. <laughs> hey, what's up? What's up with that voice? What's going on? Right. I don't know what's happening with my audio. <laughs> you know what happens to your audio? All right, man. Uh, okay, but I can hear you now. I can hear you. What, what's up? What's okay, good? I, yes, with a lot of works, but uh, we are very busy because we are in the offering different projects to our customers, so they are required us very quickly. Okay. All right. This everything is fine. All right. Sounds good. That R sound is not customers. It's customers. Customer. 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 The Customer. R R R. Customer. There you go. Customer. There you go. All right. Good job. Good job. Uh, Elena, how are you? What's good? Fine. Fine. Thank you. Um, uh, today I do some errands and well, that's all. You, I feel, you, you say you feel arrogant? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> I did some errands. Oh, you did some errands. Okay, all right. Yeah. That's good. That's good. Let's see. What about you, Catherine? How was concentric, Catherine? <laughs> today I had a very relaxing day. Uh, well, uh, but. In another hand, I did this. I was drawing this. Oh, that's cool. Um, well, that's that's pretty much what I did today. <laughs> oh, that's cool. That's good. You sent me a message today on WhatsApp. Uh, you do look like a kid. <laughs> <laughs> but Very actually, good. I'm not. I am 19 years old. You look like 12 I... or 8 or something. <laughs> Yes, I I still like I see, uh, I seem to be like I don't know, fifteen years old. Yes, I know, but well, that's good. That's good. You know, it's it's good to look young. <laughs> Thank you. People say that I look like fifteen. <laughs> of course not. Hi, right, uh, hello, uh, Jose. How was your day, Jose? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Hey, my good. day is quite good. All right, why was it good? Did you see your girl? Yes. You saw Sorry? your girl? Did you see your girl? No. No? No, no. No? You didn't understand? <laughs> I don't think you understood. No, I, I don't understand. I don't, I don't listen very well. Yes, you used Sorry. to. Oh, yeah. No, I stay at home. You stayed at home? Okay. Yes. Right. Be safe at home. <laughs> okay. All right. Good job. Good job. Um, 
Francisco, welcome. I don't know where you went, but welcome. Uh, Fatima, how are you, Fatima? Hi, teacher. Now I am a little bit tired. Oh, you're tired? Why? Because I have been doing a lot of house chores. Oh, house chores. Okay. All right. Yeah. That's good. That's good. That's good. Hey, it's good. You're a good girl. Uh, iPhone the Kevin. How are you, iPhone the Kevin? All right, remember to turn on your cameras, guys, okay? Eric Perez, welcome. welcome. Hello, sir. How are you, Eric? Eric, how are you doing, Eric? All good? Hi. All right, all good, guys. Okay, guys, so we're going to do a quick grammar review. All right, help me read question number one. I'm going to pick the people without cameras, okay? Oh, the only one without a... Okay, there you go, there you go, there you go. All right, uh, Daniel Aquino, I want to hear the, your diabolic voice. So, uh, <laughs> so tell me, what's, so what's the grammar review? Help me read. Grammar review. Tell me something that shouldn't be allowed in El Salvador and why. Okay, all right. Hey, how do you read the T and the H together, guys? How do you read that? Something, like a Z, Theft. something. Like zapato, zorro. <laughs> Got it, Daniel? Something. Yeah. All right, one more time. Something. Good job. Something. Good job, Daniel. Okay. Something. Ah, good okay. job. Good job. But it's not S. Okay, okay. It's like, how do you say gracias? Gracias. Thank you. Thank you, right? It's not <laughs> thank you. Thank you, loco. Thank you. It's not thank you, loco. Thank you, loco. <laughs> All right, good job, guys. So uh, tell me something that shouldn't be allowed in El Salvador and why, okay? So I want to hear your response. For example, I think that littering, do you know what littering is? Tirar basura. Everyone, littering. 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 All right, littering, exactly, littering. right? So, all right, so this is the meaning. Good job. All right, guys, so I think that it's littering should be allowed in El Salvador because it contaminates, it pollutes the world, it pollutes the, street, the streets, you know? And whenever you have a rainy season, the whole street gets flooded, you know, like all cities get flooded. Um, and then you got a lot of accidents and then you have people dying. And then there is a huge um, damage that, that we do to the environment. And then, you know, we have to clear the, the, the ozone layer and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Okay. All right. So give me an answer like that, guys. Right. For warm up, I'm going to give you five minutes and then we come back. Did you get the question? Did you get the question? Voy a pasar por los ruedos, no quiero que me digan más cervos. I don't want to hear that, guys, okay? All right, good job, guys. Let's go. Take a screenshot if you don't remember that. Don't worry. Let's go. Mario. Hi, Daniel. Hello. Hello. What's up? Okay. I didn't see you yesterday. Yeah, I had a lot of work. Hey, did you watch, yes. the, did you watch the class, Mario? I sent <laughs> it yeah, I did. I did, yeah. I, I, I'm already up to date. So. All right, no sounds way. good, man. Sounds good. All right, okay, continue. So. What is because of your location? Where do you live? I live in Cincinnati. Mm, but you live mm, in a rural. It's not a rural. It's it's near to the to the the middle of the the city, but in my house is the sign or it's bad. Uh -huh. you have a problem with your connection. Okay, yeah, but they have let, a problem. Let's but talk now about I the can website. listen. Okay, so what yeah. do you think is something that shouldn't be allowed here in that country? I think something something that children be allowing a Salvador is to uh, trash uh, throw out throw out trash in the on in the river because they uh, contaminate the environment and it is uh, very bad because that's a problem because um um, it's responsibility of the dog owner. Yeah, you're right. I agree with that. Okay. 
So, it's really dangerous. So what is it that shouldn't be allowed then, Eric? Uh, I was telling to Diana that um, I think that, um, for example, shouldn't be allowed to walk uh, dogs without uh, a leash. Uh -huh. Cause a dog, uh, some dogs are aggressive and, and can bite a person, yes. a child, a child on, or another dog. All right, sounds good. Good, good explanation. All right, keep it up, guys. Keep it up. Continue. Que no esté pasando. Que no que esté pasando algo. No, no, no. Algo que no deba ser permitido aquí en el Salvador. Y por qué? Ah, okay. Okay. They find you. Punishment because punishment is something like a, when when you are doing something against the law, but when you are going to correct your child behavior is another word that I can't remember right now. Ah, baby is here. He can help us. What? Uh, how how is the word that you use for uh, correct the children when they behave when they bad behave? You mean to ground them, to scold them? Yes, granting. Yes, granting. Yeah, that, that's, that is the difference between punishment and granted. Punishment is something like, uh, uh, how can I say, uh, when you are uh, hitting, when you have a fight with someone and you are punishing him, or, or when you make some robbery and the law give you a punishment that you have to be in jail for five or six or seven years, Whatever they, they have the whatever the long the the years they give you, uh, for the punishment that is when you pay for the things that you have done. So pretty and, much what he's basically there are three things right. Scold means regañar, scold. Okay. All right. Then mm -hmm. you have ground, ground. Someone is cuando le decís a un niño que se esté en su cuarto por cinco días. Eso okay. es castigar, pero castigar de manera leve, right? Like, Given the world. A un niño, right? Restringirle cosas. Y después está punishment. Punishment es castigo, pero castigo es severo. Pero puedes decir, his punishment, his punishment is, not to, uh, is for him not to watch TV. Es que él no vea televisión, right? Because he's grounded. Ah? But, but for a law or for a, for a law? rule, it's different, I think, because it is a warning or it is a fine. If you do uh something wrong or if you break the law yeah you get a fine or you get you get jail you get jail time okay so but you mean a crime you mean i have a, a felony or something like that felony, felony? But, yeah but a felony is a noun it's not it's not a verb you're trying oh, to oh. see to say that you, they're gonna get locked up locked up I, I already i already talked about locked up they're gonna get punished. Yes, uh, we were talking about that. Uh, one thing that is not allowed here in El Salvador is that when you're going to a trip in a long distance, and then just you, ha uh, you have to pee, just pull over the car and take off the the car and and, and make a pee. That is not allowed here, but there are law a lot of laws here in El Salvador. But the thing is that we did it anyway. We we don't care. Okay. All right. All right. So, but, so, yeah. but when you live in the United States, that is different. You cannot litter. You cannot oh, tease. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we city. shouldn't be allowed to litter here. That's it. <laughs> continue. Continue. Uh, yeah. Give me your examples. Give me your examples. Okay. We're gonna have to check. That one's... Okay. 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 All, right. All right. Continue, guys. Continue. Okay. You are walking and someone is smoking in that place. Yes, it could be a little bit uncomfortable. What could be uncomfortable? Smokers on the street. Smokers on the street. You think that they shouldn't be allowed? Yes, maybe they can have their own place to be smoking, I think. Okay, but what about it? So, so there, there should be a smoking place like every, every, every two meters? <laughs> yeah. Something like that. Something right. like that. <laughs> good ideas, good ideas, good ideas, right? Continue, continue. 
Yes, um, mostly because uh, uh, children is not good for people. Quirksana. Hello, teacher. How are you? I'm good. Eric, how are you, Eric? Hi, very good. Very good. Uh, I am late, but we are practicing right yeah, now. Yeah, I heard you. I hear you. What, so, what do you think? <laughs> uh, what do you think is something that shouldn't be allowed in El Salvador? Uh, we we were talking with Eric about the quarantine. It shouldn't be allowed. Because, because people people aren't prepared to uh, to take care of them. Okay, hold some, on. Some of some people. No. Quarantine shouldn't be allowed or should be allowed. Shouldn't be. Shouldn't I be mean, allowed. Shouldn't, shouldn't be. be. Uh -huh. So there shouldn't be any quarantine at all. No, it shouldn't be take off. Take off of okay, of no, 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 you mean quarantine <laughs> shouldn't be lifted. Uh -huh, uh -huh. This is the, 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 the meaning. Es que no, no, debería, no debería terminar. Uh -huh. Yes, should On quarantine the, uh, should be lifted. All right. Levantada, lifted, right? Uh-huh, uh -huh, lifted. Mm -hmm. ah. That's right. Uh, the, in El Salvador, they shouldn't be lifted, the quarantine. Yeah, that's because, that's that's true. Mm -hmm, because people, if, if you can see out, I today I was out uh, all the morning. Incredible. A lot of people, some yeah. of them without masks. Yeah. And yeah. it's a risk. Yeah, no, you're right about that. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go back and you discuss your answers in front of everybody. Okay. All right. Okay, thank you. thank you. Bye. Good job, guys. So let's discuss, let's discuss those answers, all right? Hello, David. All right, really good, guys. So let's discuss those answers right now. Volunteer, who wants to go first? Maybe uh, Daniel teacher. Uh, Daniel, let's go, Daniel. Okay. Jail shouldn't be overcrowded because the living condition of the inmates can be affected. Like the health, health care, uh, okay. the sleeping. Okay, like the health care. Okay. Is that it? Uh, no, the, the condition to sleep. Okay. The food. Uh huh. Just that. Just that. Okay, like their health care, you meant. Okay, hey. good job. Like their, not that. Like their health care. All right, good job. Okay, so, uh, so Danielle me thinks that uh, we should there have better go. conditions, you know. Uh, in jails in El Salvador. Okay. All right. Good job. Good job. Good job. Applause for Danielle, guys. That was actually good, Danielle. Danielle, pick someone else. Let's go. Tanya, come on. Tanya. Tanya. Let's go, Tanya. Hello. Um, in my personal opinion, I think that public transportation uh -huh. it shouldn't be allowed to work if they are too old. Because that is one of the reasons that there are so many um, accidents. Good job, Los Fortania, guys. I agree with that. Hey, guys, how do you say I agree? Agree? You can say that again, everyone. You, you, can, get, you can say that again. <laughs> you can say that again. Can say that again. <laughs> All, right. All right. You can say that again. All right. You can say that again. All right. This is an idiom, guys, for saying I agree, okay? You can say that again, right? Repeat, guys. You can say that again. You can say that again. That again. You can say All right. That again. All right. Do it like that. You can say that again. You can say that again. Imagine que tiene un bebé y le ponen, you can say that again. Hey, you can say that again, Manuel. Vení. Right. <laughs> my <laughs> boyfriend's name is Manuel. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. You can say that again. <laughs> you can say that again. Good job, guys. Good job. All right. Now. Only feedback that I got for you, um, you said personal. Guys, practice this sound, the R, guys, because when you talk like that, you sound you sound more more Latinos than, than I don't know, that Vicente. Latinos. All right. 
Personal. Repeat. Personal. 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 I mean, it's okay to sound Latin again. Personal. I just want you to sound with the right pronunciation, right? Per. R. Not R. 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 Personal. How do you say it? How do you say it? Good job. Good job, right? That was the only thing. Fantastic job. Good job. Pick someone else. Tania, pick someone else. Erenia. Erenia, let's go, Erenia. Okay, I think that it shouldn't be allowed to take children on bike. I mean, I, I don't know, or I'm not sure if that is not allowed, but a lot of people uh, does that action and the police doesn't say anything. So I think it's something that it shouldn't be allowed. Okay, are you are you okay? Are you saying uh, having children riding bikes? Is that what you're saying? No, uh, the adults uh, are the ones who ride the bike, but they have the children and the bike at the same oh, time. Oh, okay. So you think that? Okay, so you think that bikers shouldn't? be allowed to ride along with children is this, what, is this what you're trying to say yeah okay all right everyone repeat bikers shouldn't be allowed to ride along with children bikers should be allowed to ride along with children all right good job right it's just the vocabulary to work on your vocabulary but that that's it okay Write it down, right? This is how you actually say it. Good job. Applause, guys. Good job. All right. All right. Um, Eric Paredes, tell me something that, should, that shouldn't be allowed. Muting yourself in class shouldn't be allowed. <laughs> sorry. Sorry, sorry. That's okay. Okay. <laughs> I think that I think that shouldn't be allowed in El Salvador is um, sh uh, to walk dogs without a leash. Okay. Uh, like uh, like I said, um, some dogs are aggressive and can bite children or persons or another People dog. Need Okay, good job. Or another dog. Good job. Plus for Eric, guys. That was good, Eric. Okay, good job. No mistakes there. Okay, good job. Good job. All right. And last one, let's see. The team marine, the doping Fatima. Let's go. <laughs> okay, so I was thinking that something that shouldn't be allowed here in Salvador, it could be smokers on the street because it could be a little bit dangerous for people that are on the street because they have different illnesses and it would be worse for the, their health. So okay. maybe they have their own space to be a smoking. Okay, because if they drop their, 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 if they drop their cigarette, somebody can trip over, right? Yeah. <laughs> you didn't get it? I said, <laughs> if they drop their cigarette, somebody can trip over. Do you understand that, Mario? What, okay, can you explain it? Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't say cigarette, but I think the correct word would be cigarette butt because it's the, the missing. Oh, yeah, well, the cigarette. cigarette butt. Okay, all right, yeah. The no, cigarette. I think you mean that that is not the reason. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I'm just but saying. I mean, somebody could trip over. I mean, uh, we don't it's know how clumsy okay. people can be. Guys, what is the meaning of trip over? trip over. What is the meaning of trip over, guys? Tienes tropezar. Exactly, oh, okay. Yes. <laughs> Entonces, bromeando, digo, porque cuando botan su cigarro, right? But, but él me corrigió, all right, good job, all right, good job, right? Porque es cierto, no botas el cigarro, pero es botas el, el butt del cigarro, no sé, la colilla se llama, ¿verdad? Right? Colilla. Yeah, you, 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 you drop the, the cigarette butt. Um, entonces, yo le dije que porque alguien, porque ella me dijo que era peligroso, so somebody can trip over, I guess, puede tropezar, right? But I'm kidding, Fatima, you're good. Applause for Fatima, guys. Good job, good job, good job, right? All right, guys, so uh, it's good. Good examples, guys. I like them very much. So now let's keep going with the class, guys. Any questions regarding um, regarding models, guys? Regarding models for giving opinions? 
Did you all finish exercise 5.2? Yes? 5.2 is the one that we should have finished yesterday. The one that we did yesterday, guys, 5.2, did you finish? Yes. All right, yes. that's good then, that's good, that's good, okay. What's today's objective? Uh, let's see, Jose. Is the, in this in this class participant in this class participants will be introduced tag, to tag question for opinion. Good job pronunciation guys introduce 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 all right first of all guys no es la R de Kumas okay R intro. Repeat, guys. Introduce. 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 Introduce to tag questions for opinions. Introduce to tag questions for opinions. All right, good job, man. Good job. Applause for Jose, guys. Good job. You're great, man. All right, so. Let's listen to the examples, guys, and you're going to practice in couples, okay? All right, hold on. Can you hear? No. No, okay. No. Yeah, no. I figured. I'm sorry. No. I always forget that. Videos without sound shouldn't be allowed, right? <laughs> Pay attention to the use of tag questions for opinions. Health insurance, child care bills, rent. Now that I'm going to school and only working part time, I have a hard time making ends meet. Okay, health insurance guys, is. All right, everybody. Health insurance, child care bills, rent. Repeat. Health, health insurance, insurance child care bills, rent. Now, now that I'm going to. Now that I'm going to school and only working part time, I have a hard now time. Now that I'm going to school, I'm going to school and only, only working work part, part time. All right, remember, guys, you have to sound sad. What is what is the meaning of making ends meet, guys? Very making cool. Making the month with money. What is it? Making it to the end of the month with money, <laughs> surviving. Okay, it is it is surviving. Okay. All right, yes, it is surviving, guys. It's actually um, not being able to accomplish something, in fact, okay? Good job, man. Good job, Mr. Vocabulary. Plus for Mario, the, three words, the three words is that? Making yes. ends meet is, Make it, is a it's phrase. A, it's a phrase, yes. Making ends meet. Mm -hmm. Very so good same. job. Very good job. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So it's like able to get by. Get by, guys? What does it mean of get by, Mr. Mr. Vocabulary? I will say like... Ma barely making it, like barely survive, having money for survive. food. Survive. What is it? Yeah, survive. 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 <laughs> good job, man. I'm testing you, Mr. Grammar. You're good, man. You're good. All right. All right. All right. Let's continue, guys. What happened to the sound? Oh. oh. <laughs> what happened to the sound? For some reason. When I was working full time, rent. Now that I'm going to school and only working part time, I have a hard time making ends meet. Health insurance is really expensive, isn't it? 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 Guys, okay, isn't it, guys? This is what we're gonna talk about today. This is called what is it called, Mr. Vocabulary? Tag question. It's called a tag question. Anyone? Tag, tag question. question. Tag, tag question. question. Uh, All right, guys. Se acuerdan cuando jugaba Mika. All right, Mika se dice tag, guys. All right, así se llama en inglés. Tag, tag. Are right, your tag? Cuando vos, cuando vos tocas la Mika, así es verdad. I don't, I don't remember, guys. When you're, when you, okay, you say you're tagged, okay? You're oh. tagged, okay? You're tagged is eh, Mika. Cuando toca Tener la mica. mica, right? Tener la Mika, right? Good job, right? So you're tagged. Now, tag, guys, tag is como, como, um, it's, it's like, it's like sticking something to something, okay? Like sticking, like, like, for example, um, a price tag. Do you know what a price tag is? 
Pricing, uh -huh. lo que sale en el supermercado. Yeah. Las, el precio, donde pone eso, that, that's a tag, right? I have no idea how to call it in Spanish. But that's yeah. what I'm saying. Explain, right? <laughs> etiqueta, right? So this is basically... Etiqueta. This is basically, guys, una pregunta etiqueta. Este cuando vos decís, hey, ¿te gusta el fútbol? No. Aquí solo decimos no, right? But in English, it's a little bit different. So that's what we're going to see today. All right. Um, let's continue. Yeah. My company used to pay for it when I was working full time. Yeah. My company used to pay for it when I was working full time. Yeah. yeah, my company, my company used, used to pay for it when I was working, working full time. time. What to write for Imitate time. that intonation, guys. Very important. Yeah. And childcare isn't cheap, is it? And childcare isn't cheap, is it? And childcare isn't cheap, is it? No, it's not. After I pay for rent and groceries, almost all my money goes to pay for my son's daycare. Colleges should no, provide. Everybody. No, it's not. No. After I pay no, for rent and groceries, no, almost all my money goes to pay for my son's daycare. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. It's not. Pay for rent and groceries. No, money goes to pay for my son's daycare. daycare. Free daycare. 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 I think so too, but they don't have any services like that at my school. Everyone, colleges should provide free daycare for students in, uh, with children. I think so too, but they don't have any services like that at high school. All right, guys. So, person A, person B, you got five minutes to practice. Choose whoever you, if you want to be Sarah or Todd. Uh, I'll send the screenshot, guys, or you can simply go to the platform, okay? So, you know what to do? You know what to do, guys, so let's go. All right, let's practice, guys. Good job. Okay, I'm looking the... Oh, okay. I, I sent it to the WhatsApp group as well. Ah, okay. Sorry. Okay, I'm ready here. Okay, so health insurance, shield care, bills, rent. Now that I'm going to school and only working part time, I have a hard time making ends meet. Can I make you a correction if you allow me? Yeah. Okay, it's health, health care, health insurance, yes, child care, bills, rent. Now that I'm going to school and only working part-time, I have a hard time making ends meet. Okay, going, so. So if you want to repeat it, it's no problem for me. Okay. So. Do it again or, or, or are we going to pass on? I have a hard time making it. In SNEAT. Health insurance is really expensive, isn't it? Yeah. My company used to pay for it when I was working full time. <coughs> and child care isn't cheap, is it? No, it's not. All right, I'm sorry, man. I didn't notice. <laughs> Jose was supposed to be with you, but he wasn't here. I don't know what happened. And we oh. got Wendy. Hello, Wendy. How are you doing? Turn on that camera. Um, What's up? What's good? Hi. There I'm good. Go. All right. All good. All right. Let's practice. And long time no see, Wendy. Did you catch up? <laughs> yes, I know. The class? Um, the, the class? Yeah. Did you catch up with the exercises? Um, yes. Yes, I have the answer. <laughs> all right. Sounds good. All right. You're with a... Uh, Mr. Grammar, Mr. Vocabulary, Teacher 2.0. <laughs> yeah, I wish. Mari is really good. Mari, Mari is really good, right? Check him out, right? Okay. Let's go. Okay. Provide free daycare, free daycare for students with children. I think so too, but they don't have any services like that at my school. Good job. Applause virtual. Good job. Good job. Right. 
All right, hey, but I need more emotion, right? Drama queens, right? <laughs> okay. You sound like, right, so you, have, you have to sound sad, but sound sadder. Like, oh my God, I don't have any money for my rent, for my college, for my kid. All right. Come on, dramatize it, right? <laughs> Drama queen, okay. Okay. I have a hard time making enemies. Uh -huh. I have a hard time making enemies. Uh -huh. Cuando, cuando, eh, significa que, que le pagaban todo y de pronto ya no le pagaban nada. I'm sorry for Spanish. <laughs> no Spanish, guys. <laughs> yes, I know. Spanish. Uh -huh. At the beginning, the, the company pays everything and suddenly eh, she, ha she, she had to pay everything. This, I, I don't know, um, David, if making ends meet, it means my explanation, the extreme sort of. Okay, do you want to explain what mean, what is the meaning of making ends meet? Uh -huh. All right. Okay, uh, make, to make ends meet is pretty much to have money for survival, oh, okay. right? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. When you say that you don't have money, you don't have, you, you know that you can't, that you can't make ends meet, it means that you don't have enough money to survive. You oh, know, wow. uh, especially mm -hmm. with, with, you know, if you have family and things like that, right? It's mm -hmm. like, oh, I don't think I can make ends meet this month, you know? Or all your money is spent in, in different things. And you... No, simplemente significa, hey, pues, no tengo tanta para sobrevivir. Okay. Uh -huh. yeah, right? <laughs> Perishion, <Okay>. right? <laughs> A los Salvadorian. <laughs> Platform is um, all right. Let's go. Hi, okay, guys. Hey, guys, I noticed that some of you, like most, a lot of you actually, guys, a lot of you did, didn't understand the meaning of making ends meet. All right, so it means it, it means this, guys. Okay, let me write it down again. Uh, it's what Mario said, uh, just a little bit, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit, tiny, weeny um, difference there, okay? It means, guys, okay. to uh, to have enough money to get by. In this case, get by, change it for survive, okay? Uh, to survive. All right, so this is the meaning, guys. All right, get, hey, see what this is? Uh, I can make the ends meet. Well, I said, uh, I can make the ends meet, significa que... Tengo suficiente dinero para sobrevivir, right? Como dijo Mario, para llegar al final del mes, like something like that, right? Um, so if you say that you can't make the ends meet, it's like que no tienes suficiente dinero para sobrevivir. Got it? Got it, got it, got it, got it. You, you, you have it or you don't have it? No. Got it. Make it, si vos lo decís en positivo, if you say it in positive, it is uh, que tenés suficiente you have, dinero. You have money, right? Exactly, all right? Y sobrevivir no significa que te vas a morir de eso, sino que sobrevivir de como decimos aquí, yeah. Yeah, para sobrevivir, no, no significa que nos vamos a morir, sino que para, no tenemos mucho para comer, right? It's just a saying. Got it? Yeah. Got it. Got it. Got it right. Exactly, exactly. Good job. All right, real quick, guys, just two couples, okay? Volunteer number one, me teacher. Me teacher. Thank you, Diana. Diana picked someone who looks, who likes um, um, cornflakes. <laughs> Okay. Okay, Francisco Cepeda. Francisco, do you like cornflakes? Yes. All right, man, I, I want cornflakes right now. Let's go, uh, Francisco. You are going to be Sarah and you're going to be Todd, Diana. Okay. Okay. Health insurance, child care bills, rent, not that I'm going to school and only working part time. I have a hard time making ends meet. Health insurance is really expensive, isn't it? Yeah, my company used to pay for it when I was working full time. And childcare isn't cheap, is it? No, it's not. After I pay for rent and groceries, almost all my money goes to pay for my son's daycare. Colleges should provide free daycare for students with children. I think so, too but they don't have any services like that at my school good job plus for them both guys good job guys Woo. good job guys right plus guys plus 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 okay good job diana good job guys very nice pronunciation i don't have any uh any any trouble with you there 
Diana, the only thing that you missed is pretty much pronunciation, not the pronunciation, I'm sorry, the intonation, guys, at the end of the of the tag question. It's always like, isn't it? Repeat, guys, isn't it? 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 Right. The intonation isn't always go up, guys. La intonación siempre va para arriba en una tag question. It? Got it? Isn't it? Is it? Isn't it? All right. Good job. Lo pasar de do a mi, de un solo, right? Good job, good job, good job, right? Francisco, same thing, intonation, but very good job. Pick another couple, okay. Diana. Pick a couple. Pick okay. very nice people. Uh -huh. Okay, Catherine. <laughs> Catherine. <laughs> and uh, Eric. Eric. Catherine Paredes. and Eric Paredes. Okay, let's go. Eric, three, two, one. You're Sarah. Go. Health insurance, shaker bills, rent. Now that I'm going to school and only working part-time, I have a hard time making ends meet. Health insurance is really expensive, isn't it? Yeah, my company used to pay for it when I was working full-time. And childcare isn't cheap, is it? No, it's not. After I pay for rent and groceries, almost all my money goes to pay for my son's daycare. Colleges should provide free daycare for students with children. I think so too, but they don't have any services like that in my school. Good job, applause from them both, guys. Good job, guys. Good job. Good job. Applaud them, guys. Right? All right. Good job, guys. Uh, so, uh, Kathy, I really don't have any like work on your intonation, but it wasn't a big deal. Good job, Eric. Everything was good. Everything was good. There is something. There was just very, very, very tiny mistakes here. Okay, first one. In here, I needed to open your mouth, man. <laughs> All right, because okay. uh, you, I couldn't, I couldn't, um, I couldn't make out exactly what you were saying because it sounded like it was together, right? Uh, to pay for it. Repeat. To pay for it. To pay for it. Pay for it. Good job. How do you pay say? Pay for it? it. How do you say it, Eric? To pay for it. To pay for it. Okay. Um, use your the, your pronunciation for these, and not only for Eric, guys. I've heard a lot of you. Goes. Pronounce it, guys. Goes. Goes. It kind of sounds like this. Goes. Okay. It, it's goes. not goes, guys. Goes. Don't say goes. 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 Okay. How do you pronounce goes. it? Goes. Goes. All right. Good job. Goes. The same here, guys. It's not so. So so. No, guys. So. So. All right. It sounds like this. How do you how do you pronounce it, Eric? Oh, so, 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 okay, so, so, other than that, beautiful, beautiful job. Applause for them both again, guys. Good job, guys. Good, good job. Okay, so let's listen to the end of the conversation and answer the question. On a discussion, the rest of the conversation, what is Todd concerned about? What is the Have question, guys? What is the question? What is Todd? What is concerned about? Okay, good about. job. What is Todd? Oh, I'm sorry. Todd concerned about. Okay. What is the meaning of concern, guys? My preocupation, right? No Spanish. But Spanish, guys. Spanish, Spanish, right? All right, good job. Oops, hold on. Oh, this thing froze on me. We show it again. Now discussion box. Oh, listen to me. I'm always complaining, aren't I? Anyway, how are things with you? Oh, not bad. But I'm still not sure what I'm going to do after I graduate. Yeah, it's hard to find a job these days, isn't it? It's not that. I'm just not sure if going to law school was the right thing to do. What do you mean? I only have a few more months before I graduate, and now I'm wondering why I did this. I don't want to be a lawyer. It all seems like a waste of time now. So, what are you going to do? Well, I'd like to move to Mexico and open a coffee shop, but I think my parents would flip. I think you're muted, David. Wait, I'm sorry, can you hear me now? Hear you. Yes. yes. All right, guys, I'm sorry. All right, guys, what is the meaning of I think my parents would flip? 
they will freak out. All right, it means that they will freak out. Good job, good job, okay? It's like going crazy, right? All right, guys, so what, all right, so real quick, guys, real quick, do me, everybody, do me a favor. What is Todd concerned about, okay? According to the audio, what is he concerned about? Share your answer on the chat box right now, okay? The chat room. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Just uh, three minutes. Good job. Uh, so far, I've only gotten Roxana. He doesn't want to be a lawyer. Okay, is that okay? Good job. Uh, Marius Todd is about to graduate, but he's having doubts if he, uh, if being a lawyer is what he really wanted. He's considering opening a coffee shop in Mexico, but his parents would disown him. Okay, hey, that's good. He doesn't want to. All right, guys, you got it. You got it. You got it. Good, good, good job. Okay. All right, good job. Keep sending me the questions. Francisco, he's concerned about her parents. To know Hi is not interested in graduate as a lawyer. Okay, you gotta order that sentence, uh, Francisco. Todd is concerned about going to law school. He doesn't want to be a lawyer. Good job, Eric. Elena, Todd is concerned about studying law. He doesn't like that and just want to fly and open a coffee shop in Mexico. All right, Todd thinks he makes the wrong decision studying laws. okay. Good job, guys. All right, those were very good answers, guys. What's today's objective, Diana? Uh, by the end of this lesson, participants will learn about tag questions for opinions. Okay, guys, so we're gonna see tag questions part one right now, okay? So let me pull up the presentation here. All right, guys, so tag questions for opinions. Good job, okay? Help me read the first example. Diana, pick someone who has not participated today. Mm, Wendy. Wendy, I'm sorry, Wendy. Let's go, Wendy. Um, tag questions for opinions. Affirmative statement plus negative tag. Okay, all right, Help. hold on. Hold your horse, hold your, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Right, sorry to interrupt. Guys, uh, what's an affirmative statement? Um, something that is true. No, not something that is true. Because tu hey, um, yo salí <laughs> donde mi amigo anoche, right? Es una oración afirmativa, pero es mentira. Okay. <laughs> All right. Affirmative on, is man. affirmative is not the truth, guys. Affirmative is solo una oración positiva, right? Right. It could be a okay. very nice right. light. All right, so give me an example. Francisco, give me an example of an affirmative statement. Affirmative statement? Um, when do you were to go to work, isn't it? I'm sorry, no, just just, just a statement. Not the tax question. Just a statement? Yes. Ah, okay. Uh, when do you go to work today? When do goes to work today, okay? So when do you goes to work today okay all right very good okay this is a, an affirmative statement okay good job francisco pick someone else who has not participated uh guillermo all right guillermo all right let's go guillermo guillermo give an example guillermo yes uh -huh. um Give me something in simple present. I I I goes to I goes to pay to that today today the the foo. Okay, the foo. The foo. The foo. See the foo. The foo. Alimento. Oh, the food. Okay, it goes today. The food. <laughs> What are you yeah. trying to say? Okay. Mm 
en Okay, what are, what are you trying to say? Are you trying to say that you're trying to bring food? Food in, in the market. Okay, in the market. Pronunciation is market. 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 Good job, okay. Okay. I went to buy food, all right, in the market. Repeat, guys. I went to buy food in the market. I went to buy food in the market. Good job, market. guys. Good job. Okay, so all affirmative sentences, guys, start like this, okay? All right, guys. So now, what if I want to say that, uh, what if I want to transform this sentence, guys? I went to buy food in the market to a negative sentence. How do I do that? I didn't go to buy I food in the market. I didn't go to buy food. I didn't go, food. I didn't go to buy food. In the market. Good job. In the market. Good job, guys. Good job. Good job. Okay, now. Now, guys, that questions are these, okay? That question says, who are Mika con las preguntas, right? Es, es ponerle, all right? All right, con las oraciones positivas, right? With the positive, with the positive and negative statements, okay? So it's basically a tagging something, right? Tagging something into the question. All right, so first rule that, guys, all, all right, so rule number one, okay? So rule number one, all tag questions have a coma, okay? All of them, all right? And rule number two, guys, which, which we're gonna see later, all right? They have to be negative if the sentence is positive and vice versa. All right? So for example, guys, if I'm saying that, take a look at the first example here, okay? Let's let's read the first example. Let's see, uh, let's see who has not read read anything. I found the Kevin. <laughs> All right, Kevin. <laughs> Let's go, Mr. iPhone the Kevin. All right, Kevin, uh, could you help me read the first example? All right, Moises, can you help me read the first example? Health insurance is really expensive. Isn't it? Good job, guys. Okay, guys, is this positive or negative? Is this the, the first part without the comma, guys? Is this positive or negative? Positive. 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 And this is this positive or negative? Negative. 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 Good job, guys. Good job. Okay. Negative. All right. Let's take a look at the other way around. Uh, help me read. Uh, let's see. Fatima. Okay. Child care isn't cheap, is it? Good job. Is this? All right. So is this negative or positive? Negative. Negative. All right. Is this positive negative. or negative? Positive. positive. All right. <laughs> Significa en español, guys. Uh, el cuidado de niños no es barato. Lo es, right? O lo, all right. So it's the same in Spanish, pretty much the same, right? Health insurance is really expensive. Uh, el seguro de salud es es realmente caro. O, o, o no, all right? In Spanish we say like that, guys. I don't know how to say it in Spanish. Okay, it doesn't make too much sense. No, no we don't say that. Man. No, we say we say like we say something like verdad, right? Bakesi. Applause, guys. Good job. Good job. Bakesi. Good job, right? She's teaching in Spanish, okay? All right. No, guys. Okay. Uh, so, do you understand so far positive versus negative? Who has a question? Yes. Who has a question so far? So far. Yes. Nadia? Nobody? Okay. Number chill, right? Good job. All right. Uh, example number two. Um, Eric, let me read example number two. Me? Yes. There are lots of criminals in the city, aren't there? Good job. Okay. All right. Positive and negative. All right. Next one. Eric Paredes. Eric Diaz. Oh, yeah. Eric, Eric Diaz. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> there aren't enough police, are there? Repeat, guys. There aren't. 
There aren't. There aren't. All right, guys, don't say aren't. There say aren't. 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 I just aren't. like this, guys. First of all, it's the, the aren't. aren't English, not in Spanish. Aren't. It's just aren't. 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 No. All right. Aren't. Don't pronounce the aren't. okay? Aren't. All right. Good job. Manhattan. Good job. All right. Uh, continue. Um, continue, Eric. Continue. Finish them all. Next. Yes. Negative or positive? Graffiti? Uh, a graffiti. Mm -hmm. Graffiti may make everything look ugly, doesn't it? Good job, right? Next one. Colleges should provide their care. Shouldn't, shouldn't they? Good job. Next one. Sorry? Next, next one, next one. Uh, possibly negative? Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. Uh, the negative one. You can find an affordable child car, can you? All right, good job. Plus for Eric, guys. Good job, good job, good job, all right? So guys, first of all, uh, take a look at this, okay? What do we call this in grammar? Is, are, what do we call this, guys? To be. The person. All right, it, it's the verb to be, guys, the verb to be, okay? All right, what do we call should and can't? Models. 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 What do we call don't or, or do? Auxiliary. More auxiliary. Auxiliary. Good job, guys. Yeah. Right? All right. So we're going to learn about that too, guys, because you um, don't only use this with isn't it or aren't, but you also use it with models as well. Okay? So it's what we're going to start seeing tomorrow, guys. So tomorrow we're going to see this and we're going to do the, um, the exam for question. I mean, for tag questions. All right? But All right. right now, guys. It's been an absolute pleasure having you with me here, guys. We only have two days left. Let's get ready, guys, because on Thursday we have our final exam, okay? So we need, Tomorrow we, okay. we have a test? No, it's going to be on Thursday. Mm. All right, tomorrow we're going we're gonna to finish this. And on Thursday, vamos a hacer la prueba completa todo, en toda la clase, right? Okay. Like section okay. five, okay. pretty much, right? All right, guys, so see you guys tomorrow. I have another class. See you, you guys see us. See, okay, see you. Thank you for being here, guys. Good night. See you. Good night. Okay, you. Take care, guys.